Welcome back guys to another video. I'm bringing you part 2 for this q and uh, I'm going to film this and uh, upload it sometime. I'm not sure, but the main video, part 1, which is about 12 minutes long, uh, should have been uploaded uh, on Saturday. So I'm not sure when you guys will be seeing this. Probably just, uh, when I don't have an upload, I'll probably upload this to answer some more questions. Uh, but let's get into this. This might maybe be one or two more parts. Uh, this I'll stick at about maybe 6 minutes for this part. And then if I have to make another part, I will. But let's get straight into it. Uh, do you do YouTube full time? And if not, what do you do other than YouTube? I kind of mentioned this in the previous video, uh, which is a little uh, recap. Uh, pretty much BrickLink, YouTube, and uh, normal chores that teenagers kind of do. Uh, sorry for all the comments, blah, blah, blah. Oh, here's this guy. Yeah, all right. Uh, do you think you'll ever get bored of Legos? Uh, and probably not, uh, to be honest. I mean, maybe building mocks, but collecting, probably never. Uh, not answering that. Would you give all your Legos to your future kids? I mean, I wouldn't give them to them, but I plan on, you know, doing stuff with them, collaborating, you know, if, they, if they're in the Lego too, uh, you know, get some stuff for them. I mean, I'll, I'll probably pass down some of my stuff without a doubt, for sure. I'm not going to be you know, like that, but uh, hopefully, you know, I can get them into it as well. Uh, I'm not going to answer that. You know, GF, you think it would be cool? She likes Legos. So yeah, I don't know if this guy's joking or not, but I mean, that would be ideal, I guess. I mean, it, it would be fun, uh, but I don't really need that, I guess. Um, since, I mean, to be honest, I think I build better by myself, um, because I believe on the, what mock was that, on the, on the 2014 Genosius mock, I think my dad tried to help me, like, I just told, like, something that was, like, gonna be really repetitive, and I just told my dad, you know, hey, can you just, like, do this for me, but, like, it just ended up, I don't know, I just, I just work better by myself. I do have a GF, uh, no, uh, what's your favorite Lego series, like, Star Wars, Marvel, or not, or, or what? Lego series, uh... I don't know, this is Star Wars something, I guess. How old are you, 16? Have you, have you and your dad ever built anything together? Uh, like I said, no, I mean, aside from just, like, him help, he, him, like, help me sometimes. Uh, a few times, uh, he would build, like, a Lego set for me if I'm running out of time and I kind of need it done. Like, he built the TIE Striker for me, uh, you know, because, like, I had to get it out that day, so he had to hurry up and build that for me while I was still finishing up the mock. Other than that, we haven't, like, built anything together. Um, how old were you when you started buying Legos? When I started buying, I was maybe 11 when I started first being able to afford stuff, like anything myself. Um, probably about 11. Do you like the new summer sets? Uh, they're alright. Uh, I have pictures of them on my channel. Um, they're not bad. I'll, you know, once again, I'll probably pick them all up. What's one future Star Wars set Legos should make? Mm, uh, Trade Federation Battle Sphere, I guess. I mean, that'd be pretty cool. What's your favorite and least favorite Lego set I've made in the last five years? Least favorite? Any of the Yoda Chronicles or what's the other one? The new, whatever the hell that's called, whatever, with like the Thai stuff, whatever the other TV show is, just whatever trash that like that, it's pretty stupid. Um, favorite? Ah, uh, that's a tough one, Sandcrawler, some of that, Y-Wing that just came out, stuff like that. Least favorite and favorite movies, excluding Star Wars. Uh, least favorite. That's kind of hard, you know. I don't. I haven't seen that many movies. Like, I usually don't watch movies I know I'm not gonna like. That's the thing. Like, there's only been a few movies like where I'm stuck watching it because you know I'm watching it with someone else and like I kind of have to. But favorite movies, uh, the, the 2009 or 10 Avatar. That was a good movie. Jurassic World, uh, The Dark Knight Rises has always been a favorite. Um, yeah, stuff like that. Civil War was alright. Winter Soldier, though, that was really good. Um, how did you get into collecting Lego? Uh, my brother pretty much passed down his collection, which he had a bunch of, like, 90s stuff. Um, some of it was complete, some of it wasn't. I still have a little bit of it. I could probably scavenge throughout my, my part collection. And then, I believe, I don't know, after that, I just got into it. And I believe my dad started buying me a few sets, like, uh, with, like, Aqua Raiders are still on the shelf. I remember that. Then we went to the Lego store, bought some stuff. I believe that Christmas is when I got you know, a lot of my stuff, and that just kind of you know, I just kept on I just kept on wanting it, I guess. Uh, what was your favorite first Lego Star Wars sets? The Anakin Starfighter and the Hyena Droid Bomber, both of those at the same time, uh, back in like 2008. Uh, how old are you? What do people in your school think of your Lego hobby? Do you uh, think it's childish and stuff like that? Uh, I mentioned this in other videos. Only like six or seven people know. I mean, more people have been realizing it. Um, I mean, I've been telling them. It's not so much like it's been sp spread around throughout them. Uh, but, I mean, it's just pretty much people I trust. And it's just like, 
Uh, I know, like, this isn't going to be the same for all of you guys. I might sound cocky saying it, but it's like when you have, you know, like my size of my channel, and, you know, my friends always wonder, you know, where do I get all my money from? And it's just like they want to know this is where I get it from. And, you know, I'm just saying <laughs> I make more money than most of them, uh, you know, by doing this. So it kind of has a factor in, you know, to, into it. Um, I know a few of them, like I said, uh, you know, said they're like, you know, happy and stuff like that, pretty proud of me. Uh, you know, just kind of, it's pretty cool how I can do this. I've had other people, you know, want to make channels too. I know a few people, but, you know, they're not really going anywhere. Um, I've got plans, kind of. Me and a few of my friends might be doing stuff kind of soon. Uh, so, there might be a video out on that sometime. But they really, they don't care, the ones that do know. I don't plan on pu making it public anytime soon. Uh, maybe eventually, but the ones that do care don't really, uh, or the ones that do know don't care at all. Why did you start YouTube? Uh, really just to make videos that was just fun or something to do. Uh, least favorite Star Wars set. Any of those Yoda Chronicles uh, stuff. Uh, this is going to be probably... Actually, I'll save this for the next video, actually. So that's going to be this part, guys. Uh, this is part two. I'll make a probably part three. That's probably all I need. And uh, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned for more. See you guys later.